Hey everybody, Tim here for another Star Wars video. We got Resistance Season 2 Part 3. I've already forgotten where we are. Uh, episodes 11 through 15, because we're doing them in groups of five. I mean, it's not bad, but like, like I said, I think I mentioned it in the last video, like, I feel like it's slowly going down. You can kind of tell they didn't know what to do. So the first season was fantastic. It was really, really well done. And then for it to end at the same time as The Force Awakens, it was fantastic. And then for this one, they were like, what's what's happening? Like, do we connect it to Rebels? What do we do? And they just, they just don't know. So every episode is just kind of its own little thing. So episode 11, Station to Station, is where, like... We, we find a new space station, Titan, that is very, very similar to the Colossus. And, of course, Kaz is trying to, like, find some new stuff to, like, replace the broken parts. It's interesting. General Hux showing up is probably, like, the closest, like, connection that we get. But it's not great. Like, it's, it's okay, but it's not fantastic. It's like, oh, okay, that's done. Moving on. So, episode 12, Missing Agent. The funny part is about this one. So we meet a new character, North Kev. And I swear to God, the entire time I saw him, I like, I love Hamilton. I think Hamilton is fantastic. Great. It's on Disney plus right now. Go watch it. And every time North Kev spoke, I got the, like, uh, what did I miss song stuck in my head when, when Jefferson comes back. And sure enough, uh, Corif North Kev is played by uh, David Diggs, and who's the same actor. And I was like, that's great. And he's in the rest of the series as this character. So I was like, this is amazing. Super excited. Super happy. Uh, and that's about it. Like, that's about it. This whole episode is just about him. And he's so well done. Like, all I've seen him in, realistically, is Hamilton. So to see Diggs in this, he's great. Absolutely loved it. Uh, episode 13, Breakout. Yeager and Snar get captured, and they break out. I mean, there's there's not a lot to these episodes. They're so quick. Uh, episode 14, Mutiny, is really interesting because we see the, the battle droids from, like, the old, like, the prequels, Clone Wars, etc. Roger, Roger, come back. So, loved that. I thought it was really, really great to just see those characters return. I absolutely love them. And then the, the final episode for this one, New Worlds with the Underwater Aliens. Again, like, I mean, I didn't hate it. I did enjoy it. I sat back. I liked it. I was like, okay, that's fun. But it didn't, like, have me jumping for joy. I wasn't freaking out. So it is what it is. So, I mean, I'm liking this season. I do think this is worth a watch. If you've never seen this series before, definitely check it out. But then again, if you've never seen the series, why are you watching this video? So, I mean, I liked it. I think this is a good show. I wish it had continued. But unfortunately, this is also the penultimate episode. One more left after this. So, for those who have seen it, what would you think? Let me know. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And I will see you guys next time for the finale.